Good morning. This is Janet from Port Monkeys. We are in Falmouth. No, we're not. Weymouth. Start over. We're in Weymouth. <laughs> Actually, Portland. But the shuttle's going to take us to Weymouth. It's a big double decker bus. Some of our friends out here. Florida, Orlando. We're driving through Portland. 25 days, you will never have that. Yeah, that's a, that's a good time. Have you been on that one? Yeah, no, no. I am glad I'm not driving this bus. I'm not sure that we're going to fit through. Wow. There are a lot of houses up there. The new locks have supposed to gone through the old one earlier. It looks like we're going on a long spit across. This is the public beach between the two. And then you've got a lot of houses along the shore line. And a little boat dock. And now we're across the inlet at Weymouth. I guess that was Chesapeake Beach that we passed by. Okay. Lived in Tampa for a while. Yeah. Eleven months. Yeah. My daughter's there. Before, before they built the house. This area reminds me of the Harry Potter books. What I had envisioned in my mind that England looked like. Suitable for long vehicles. That's the brewery over there. And we're going to try to make our way into the center of town. Spring Road, Newberry Gardens. Here's a map. And we are here. You have to watch your footing. Look at this, Carol. Everywhere. Everywhere. There are pavers all over the ground, but there are also little gradual down steps, up steps. So you really have to pay attention to your footing. Hi. She's from the visitor center. Yes, we're volunteers, yes, meeting the cruise ship passengers, yes, to welcome you to Weymouth and give you directions at all if you need any help. Yeah, I usually meet the mayor. I get to wear the well, I'm very sorry. Flag. He's busy today. Well, I did in, in Falmouth. Do they get a lot of cruises? Cruise We've ships? got 64 cruise ships coming in this year, Ooh, yes, yes. 64 cruise ships coming um, in this year. It's a bit more than normal, but obviously due to the pandemic. But we yeah. have had cruise ships in the bay, actually, because obviously they've not been allowed to do 
yeah. cruise yeah. ships as yeah. such. So we've had them all docked in Weymouth Bay. We've had the Queen Mary, Queen Elizabeth Hall Park there. Ah, what's your name? My name is Janet. My name is Janet. Snap! <laughs> Look, a fellow Janet. <laughs> this is the Brewer's Quay. It's an old brewery from the 1800s. And now they're going to convert them into flats. Public toilets. Gents, handicap accessible, and ladies. This is the center of the square. In the Portland Ferry, Jurassic Cruises. <laughs> We're crossing a bridge now. Weymouth Harbor Bylaws. We came from that side of the bridge, walking through town. We're walking down one of the main streets, Federated House. Oh, wow. Cobble keys and teas. Miniature guitars, bicycles, drum set. Walking down the main street still. Yeah. It's a long, a big thing. winding road. The bedding stores. Bedding lounge. They have those in every town, don't they? Mm -hmm. Ah. Mm -hmm. Want to place a bet? <laughs> Fruit and vegetables at Bridget's Market. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. The big issue is kind of a free sort of socialist newspaper. Ah. Oh. 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 Oh.
fancy dress. Which fancy dress? Costume. Ah. Costume party. Oh, fancy dress party. Fancy dress sold here. So that's costumes. You can get a watering can with your name on it. Can you see those ice creams there? Wow. It's Bluebird Coaches. You can plan your next vacation. Here are some choices for you. Super Bloom at Tower of London, Germany, Medieval, Ultimate Ireland, the Wild Scottish Highlands, Heart of England, and Norway. As you can tell, prices are not that cheap. We're on the seaside now. There are some hotels on this side. And the beach right across the way. So we got this handy dandy map from Janet. Beach and Harbor History Trail. It's 1.4 miles and the first stop is the Jubilee Clock, which is right ahead. Family fun at the Royal Arcade. You can also get traditional ice cream at Rossi's Ices. But there is the Jubilee Clock. We've come to the circle here where to get to the other side of the street, you've got to go down this walkway. I was wrong about that. You don't have to go down the stairs just across the street. Wait, it's, only if you stay on the main road. That's if you wanted to stay on the main road. Here is the Jubilee Clock. It's got the right time. We're along the beach. It looks like they've recently tractored through here. You can see tire tracks and marks. And it says, bathing water quality, Weymouth Central. Weymouth Central is a European bathing water and is monitored by the Environment Agency from May to September. <laughs> I don't know if you can see way down there. there. It looks like a lighthouse with stripes on it. Actually, it's a slide going from the top to the bottom and it is a helter-skelter. You can rent a kayak or a bike here. A kayak is 10 pounds per half hour. A bike is 350 for 30 minutes. They've got no shortage of them. 
from Jackson's Fish and Chips around the corner. Over around through there. There's the Helter Skelter. Around the beach. Walking out to the point. Helter Skelter. Yeah, it's like the first water slide. <laughs> oh, I see. Sand sculptures on Weymouth Beach. Oh, it's Beauty and the Beast. Oh, it's in Weymouth. Open daily for 10 30 a.m. Yeah, this is just an example. We're in Weymouth. There's a sc sculpture park. 1.2. 1.25 miles east along the waterfront. We walked along the beachfront. Pretty sure we go up here. Okay. Looks like a pavilion of some sort at the well, corner. We'll go around that, I think. Yeah, for her things she's got listed. Yeah, I think we have to go around this building. Right, around the building, I see. Where it says sea cruises, that way. I like this, how they built their little retaining wall. It's a curved retaining wall. Uh-oh. Right here. You're walking along and then this jumps out. Simon and Garfunkel are coming. What? Sunday, 22nd. It says the Simon and Garfunkel story. Oh, that must be a ship. Just down below and start tripping the hand. You can take sea cruises here. We got the sailing club. the corner here and it's cute not sure what our next stop is these steps are supposed to be the steps that the first division during World War II came before going to Omaha Beach. They look like those steps down there. Embarkation, June 1934. Beach and Harbor History Trail. In memory of Richard Clark, captain and pilot of Weymouth, who in 1583 sailed thence to join Sir Humphrey Gilbert's voyage of discovery to Newfoundland. It's very cloudy misty, a little bit cold, but it's very pretty through there. And now we're going to walk. There's a sign there that says showers and toilet facilities for yacht and boat crews. When you go inside it says not for public use and they won't let you in. The Royal Dorset Yacht Club. Sailors of Bethel, built in 1866 as a Christian institute for seamen. Here were formerly the 18th century baths.
Australian Commonwealth Military Forces, AIF, in memory of Anzac volunteer troops who after action at Gallipoli in, in 1915 passed through hospitals and training camps in Dorset. These Anzac troops later moved from Dorset to action in Palestine and the Western Front. Anzac Memorial. We will remember them. Here's another memorial. Dedicated to the men and women of the merchant navy and fishing fleets who gave their lives willingly for the freedom of others. They have no known graves with the sea. We will remember them. So we came from the beach over there and we're gonna go up to this church straight ahead. We've got a statue of the Queen Victoria and a beautiful church, St. John's Church. And then we're coming down straight towards the beach again. The houses on this side are made out of stone and block. Beautiful homes here. They almost look like little castles, don't they? Weymouth Town Council, welcome to Green Hill Gardens. We are right next to the ocean, and Green Hill Gardens is open to the public with no charge. their seedlings. Looks like they're going to put them right in here. Here's a wishing well. Here's Weymouth's wishing well. For a coin, a wish it will sell. To charity, your coin will go. A wish is secret, as you know. No one should hear what it's about. So whisper your wish. Don't shout and you can put your coin in there. Drive it back to the ship. This is going to be really poor quality. Edwards home. This concludes our day in Weymouth. England. We walked about five miles from getting back on the bus. So from England, this is Janet from Port Monkeys saying see you in the next port. Bye.
starting to rain and Ray remembered he has a poncho. So we're gonna watch him struggle putting it on. <laughs> While he's struggling with putting on his poncho, I'm gonna record some lawn bowling. We have success. Yay! Smile for the camera, Ray. We did it. <laughs>